breakups are common between celebrities. Many stars succeed in getting their relationship to the next level, and many do not, and Shawn Mendes and Camila Cabello are two names that break up recently. Their fan got shattered when they heard the news about the breakup. Some people don't believe that they break up because these two look too fine together, but what can we do? A few months ago, Shawn Mendes announced that Camila Cabello is not his Santa anymore. They both write the same message on their Instagram post. Then, on November 17, they broke up. But after the breakup, once again, they are the news, because they both spotted together. Moreover, Sean releases the first song after the breakup. Camilla comes forth and praises her ex-boyfriend's new song, It'll Be Okay. A piece of news said that Camilla got the chance to hear this song before the release. Also, she gives the final decision of releasing the song. Trusted sources publish all this news. According to sources, the song was written by Sean when he was shattered after the breakup. This song is also dedicated to their relationship. According to some sources, Sean starts writing the song when they start falling apart from each other. So what's going on? Are they planning something new? What are they going to give to their fans next? All these questions concur after their recent meeting. So let's find out in this video. But before starting, please subscribe to our channel. On our channel, you will get a lot of new gossip about celebrities. If you love the same, press the bell icon and stay updated about our videos. What the gossip going on in town? Before jumping to a conclusion, let's talk about what is going on. A source tells that in the relationship of Sean and Camilla, Sean was the one who called up the breakup. He claimed that the thing was not going well between them. And after this conversion, they both get to agree on the breakup. Some sources say that things worsen in their relationship when the world opens again after lockdown. Because during the lockdown, they both seem very happy. Also, they enjoy each other company. So then what happened that these two end up with a breakup? During the lockdown, they take a long break from work and spend much time with each other. We also see the PAP walk photo of these two during pre-pandemic. The one reason behind their breakup can be their different direction of career. Like they want to grow their career, this relationship takes a lot of time. And they are not giving each other enough space. There can be many reasons, but Sean and Camilla only know the real truth. A newspaper said that too much attention from the media breaks their relationship. Especially Sean gets affected by this attention. When they are in a relationship, the news of their engagement is also going on, but their breakup shuts all the mouth. Now, no clue if they will be together in the future or not. However, they respect each other and are good friends until now. But a recent source spotted them together in Miami. So in January 2022, they once again spend time together. On January 6, the picture of them comes out. They both look happy together on the beach. They are smiling in pictures. So it can be a sign that we once again see them together. A new paper published that when Sean is in Miami, he wants to spend his time with friends, but wants to make sure that he spends some time with Camilla. As this reunion happened, when they both meet up in Miami, they talk a lot. So, in conclusion, we can say they both are still in love and don't know how to express it and live with this relationship. For Mendes, it is tough to live without Camilla, and that comes back both together. Now both don't know how long they go and what next they have to do in their lives. A source also confirms that Sean said to his family that he couldn't find another woman like Camilla. What social media show about them? If you are only thinking about Sean about this relationship, you are wrong because Camilla also has a hard time. Cabelo cleared all his photos with Sean in her Instagram account. It shows how hurt Camilla is. After the breakup, she spends her time with nature. She also owns some pets, so she spent her time with those pets to recover from heartbreak. She is posting many pics with her dog. Sean is less active on social media, so we can't say how he is dealing with the breakup, but surely he is hurt too. He posts some beachy pictures on his Instagram account. In one of his Instagram videos, he tells a fan that he has a hard time with social media. So now it is tough to tell how they deal with the breakup but they are spending some time together to give their fans some good news. The music video of Sean. As we all know, Sean is a very good musician, and he releases some amazing songs, and recently he launches his new song. This is his first song after the breakup, and the second thing is it is a breakup song. However, we don't know when the song was made of. Before the Sean Camilla breakup, Sean made this song after the breakup, but song lyrics clear that the song is made for Sean Camilla breakup. The song lyric is like, are we gonna make it? The song is also clear that he does not think the reason behind the breakup is Camilla. 
And also, he doesn't have any hard feelings for Camilla. A line of the song that says, I will love you either way, shows that there are chances that we can see them together in the future. But we know only get a song from Sean. Camilla also performs on her upcoming album song. So we'll also see a new release song by Camilla. When they break up, people say that it is because of work. But these songs make clear that the breakup is not because of work. There is another reason behind it. Still, we can't figure out the main reason behind this. But we will give you an update when we find any other source. We can only say that the problem starts in lockdown, and the result we see is a breakup. When the song of Sean was released, fans got excited and flooded the comment section. Camilla also comments in the song saying, You're crazy wildcat. The song was released after two months of breakup. We can see the pain in Sean's voice. This shows how much this break hurt him. Sean said he connected with the song personally in one of his Instagram videos. He shares that he has recently been not good with social media in the same video. He shared a two-minute video on his page and said he would act more from now on. And then, he also posts about thanking the fans for the amazing response to the song. He says that when he makes the song very emotionally, he wants to reveal some truth about him through the song. Sean shared that he didn't want Camilla to leave in pain. He wants to see Camilla happy in her life. And before becoming friends with each other, they have to learn to leave without each other. As we know, when they announce their separation, they clear that they will remain good friends. But it is tough to leave without each other after a breakup for both. He also expresses that he pays attention to his inner thought when he makes the song. Like this, he explains his music to fans. Let's see what happens next. We can't say that they will come together once again or not. If they come there, fans will be very happy, but we can't say. On our channel, we talk a lot about celebrities. If you are interested in the same, then watch over other videos and check out our channel. You will love it. We don't know about Sean and Camilla, but we will grow together. So we share all the information that comes from Sean and Camilla. We collected all the sources and made this video. This channel brings exciting and real news that you want to know about celebrities. So if you like to have some life updates and gossip about celebrities, become a member of our YouTube family. So if you like the video, press the like button and subscribe to the channel to know about the next upload video. Then, press the bell icon to get timely updates and the top news about your favorite star. Till then, stay safe and make yourself happy.